hi there so today i'm gonna tell you about my hair it's been i've had this hair in for now three weeks i believe three weeks yeah so i have in the malaysian curly the princess malaysian curly in 18 And I, 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 be, I believe it's 18, 20, and 22. You can check my last video because I, I basically said everything about the hair. So, so far about this hair, it's amazing. I love it. And especially since it's my first time with curly hair, it's not that hard to maintain. As long as you, let me show you what you need. As long as you have the stuff that you need, Taking care of curly hair is not a big deal. I know that when you see, you know, some YouTube videos, they talk about how, oh, curly hair is high maintenance. It takes a long time. You have to have patience with it. But honestly, you just need to give yourself at least 10 minutes every morning to take care of your hair and your hair is good for the whole day. That's basically what you need. And with this hair, it's a girl, a guy, whatever, girl, it's easy. It's, it's easy. In the morning, I wake up. I go to the bathroom and the first thing I do is I spritz my hair with this little concoction I have. It's cold water, this, the cream of nature argan oil, leave-in hair milk, and my Moroccan um, conditioner, everybody, the Moroccan argan oil conditioner, everybody knows that. So I put in this bottle, I put about, about two spoons, now don't put a lot, because if you put a lot, it's, it's not good. You just put about a little bit, you just squirt like two pumps in it. And with the same conditioner, you squirt two pumps. Then you fill up with water halfway like this and then you shake it until you don't see it anymore, until it's completely like this. And then you add more water, shake it a little bit and you let it sit overnight. And this is before, you, after you get your sewing done or your wig done or whatever, do this before you go to sleep so that it can like, you know, marinate or you know get it all together in the thing whatever so that's what you do so yeah when I wake up I spritz my hair with this I have a I spritz my hair with this and then with this I only use this since it's already in here I don't always put this in my hair after I spritz it with my little concoction I do this about once a week so in the morning, I will spritz my hair, then I will take a nice little palm size, and then I will, you know, rub it in my hair, brush it out, and that. That's all that. And so after that, I use my diffuser. Now this little thing, you're gonna need it. Well, you don't, you don't necessarily need it, but it helps a lot. It helps your hair, you know, get bigger. You know, like some people want that big, big hair, don't care. Like if you want that big hair, don't care, you're gonna need this. Cause after you wet it, you know, when you put it up like this, it adds volume to like where the roots are. So it kind of lifts it up a little more and more. And it helps you, you know, go big or go home. And if that's why you like it, then hey, this is what you need. And also, what's that? So when it comes, so when it comes to doing my leave out, my hair is permed. My hair is not natural; it's permed. So you already know, trying to blend this is gonna be hard. No, it's not hard at all. So <clears throat> the way my sewing is, I have a sewing, and so it's this is where the tracks. The track. I don't wanna lift it up because I just put it down. But like this is where the track is. So I have this much leave out. I have very little, I don't have no edges out, nothing in the back, nothing, I don't have nothing out. So my sewing is right here, then I have that little hair out. Yes, it's a little hair out, but still, come on, my hair is bone straight and this is like some tight ass curls. So what you need, you need any, it doesn't have to be this brand, you just need any type of foaming wrap lotion any type of foam and wrap lotion in your set so what you do is you you know just part your hair however it is that you want so after you put this in you just get your blow dryer and you just blow dry the top and i don't know how it works it works that's all that's all that needs to know 
that oh we need to know where it works so when you blow dry it, it's kind of since this thing the curly hair is wet with this and your hair is wet with this once you put the blow dry on it it kind of curls not curl but your hair your natural hair kind of matches the pattern of how the curly hair is when you blow dry because it it's already wet and it's already in that like you know curved pattern so when you blow dry your hair kind of gets into that pattern and it looks good curls they always come back I only oh but here's one thing I want to say I want to say you don't have to wash this hair like every other day like you see other people all in their videos it makes no sense like what's the point you're already wet in it with this you're co-washing it you're basically kind of washing it so I washed this hair one time since I got it on last weekend and that was what two weeks after I did the hair that's when I washed it so that's probably what I'll do. I'll wash like every two or three weeks. Like it doesn't need to be washed every day. It's just a waste of your time, honestly. I mean, if you want to wash it every day or every other day, go ahead and do it. I'm, I'm not saying it's wrong, but I think it's a waste of time to wash your hair every day. It makes no sense. Unless you don't take care of the hair, obviously. When it gets one nappy and shit in the back. If you don't not take care of your hair, then it makes no sense in getting curly hair or any kind of hair. It black doesn't matter. So, um, yeah. I want to straighten the hair. I want to straighten this hair. But I'm kind of scared. I mean, I told my friends the other day how oh, I'm going to straighten the hair. And they were like, oh no, don't do that. It suits you. The curly hair suits you. I'm like, yeah, I get that. Thanks. But, you know, I want to straighten the hair. I want to straighten hair. You know when you get your hair done and you got that set hairstyle and then you see someone else with a hairstyle and you're like, damn, I want to do that. But you just did this hairstyle so like... I've seen so many people with straight hair and I'm like damn it looks nice on them and like I want some straight hair like I want some straight hair so I want to straighten it but I'm kind of scared that the curls will come back but you know when I you know in my first video I did the straightening test and the curl came back I don't even know which one I did on to be honest and the curl perfect so I'll probably do a video on that yeah I will I'll do it I'll probably do it next week I was gonna do it this weekend but I have a break I'm like next week or two weeks. So I'll do it then. Cause it's been snowing in New York like crazy and like ain't nobody trying to get their hair messed up after they straighten it. Like it took a lot of work. So yeah, that's it. The hair doesn't shed. The hair I have nothing bad to say. The hair is good. I like I really like it. And for my for it being my first time with curly hair and I have no problems, it's good. I like the hair. Good hair. And if you're thinking about getting this hair, I really I highly suggest that you get it. I really think you should get it. It's not a waste of money. And the prices are yo, the prices listen. I love the prices. Because like, I'm going AliExpress and look at prices. But you know, AliExpress, nothing there's nothing wrong with AliExpress, but them prices when it's be when it be like $90 for three bundles, it's kinda like, eh. Sh should I? You know, I'm I'm kinda desperate. I don't wanna spend all this money, but like but, but, but should I? But still. I really, I really do think that you should get this. If you want to get this hair, get it. Get it, get it, get it. It's good hair. It's really good hair. I really like it. Ooh. Yes, baby. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. 